here and welcome to Rockwall, Texas Living, the web's biggest blog on the smallest county in Texas. Is that right? I almost said the smallest county in history for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, we're here in Texas. <laughs> well, it's real estate update today and this is for the week of May 24th through the 30th, so closing out May. Right. And uh, that's 2010, so let's dive into the numbers. Yeah, we got to remember that one thing is that the April 30th $8,000 tax credit right. stopped and everybody scheduled their closings for the end of May. So it's been kind of crazy at the end of May. Yeah. And but we did have a lot of closings this uh, month. Yeah, and it was it was kind of lighter at the beginning of May, I think because a lot of the people that would have closed at the beginning of May went ahead and Pushed made it for the April deadline. Right. Got their money, their fake money. Fake money. They'll get it in a couple months. It was it's out there somewhere. Checks in the sure. mail. Yeah. And you know about the mail. And the government. <laughs> and you know about the government. <laughs> All right, here we go. 662 listings. Whoa, okay. that's really good. We're up there. Rolling, got a nice bell curve, bong and wrong. Yeah, yeah. 20 sales. And look at that. 150 to 250. That category. We've been listening to the fact that a lot of homes below 300,000 are selling, above 300, 350. It's been a little bit more difficult for right. those homes to right. sell as we see right here, as opposed to the 12 over there. Okay? Okay. So, uh, good numbers, 97% uh, norm, which is good, 97 or 98% is what we're always looking for. Yeah, that's about what we run yeah. in this area. Yeah, 74 days on the market. Wow, even at the extended ones there, that's only uh, yeah. a little bit above what yeah. normal. Four months or so. Right, so that's been really well, uh, really happening good, and then uh, well, I, I, yeah, I just want to point these out. So four months here, but pretty much everything else is like one and two. Right, know? right. So if the home is priced right, looks right inside, it will sell. Yeah, we just were at a meeting today where the whole discussion is you got to price it right. Well, it's, it's, it's just not going to move in this. this uh, there's too many options. Yeah. yeah they're it's not going to move. Okay. 651 showings for 662 properties, so one a piece on an average, but that doesn't pan out because there are some that are priced too high and they're not getting any showings. And there's some that are priced right and they're getting lots. Yeah, so, so. we got a good percentage breakout there of how that 651 breaks out. Um, pretty much the bell curve again, and that's what Rockwell's all about. The bell curve. The bell curve, <laughs> right. Well, very good. Well, we look forward to hearing from you guys, and uh, let us know if you have questions or yeah. comments, concerns about the market. We can tell you whether those concerns should be uh, realized or, or, or not. <laughs> so, yeah. anyways, uh, we hope you guys are having a great day. We're learning a little bit more about Rockwell, Texas together every day. We'll see you next time.